Today we are in Eustis and behind us is Oakwood Smokehouse. Now, we have been to an Oakwood before and that was in Lady Lake. We thought it was absolutely amazing. Some of the best barbecue we have ever had. And we thought we would give it a try at another location to see if they can, sorry, the traffic's loud, see if they can uphold their quality of barbecue at another location. So that's what we're gonna do today. Let's go check it out. I didn't really know where this location was, but in yesterday's video, I went to Planet Smoothie, and as we were leaving Planet Smoothie, I was like, there's an Oakwood right here. So that's why we decided to come to this Oakwood and see if it's the same quality as all their other locations. I sure hope so. Correct me if I'm wrong, comment below, but I feel like different Oakwoods have a few different items on the menu, just based on what some comments have said, I feel. So we'll go through the menu here and see, and we'll check the hours out. It says hours of operation, Monday through Saturday, 11 to eight, Sunday, 11 to three. Of course, there's their website that'll show all their locations on it. And as we go in, oh, it smells delicious. And this is what it looks like on the inside. And then we also have restrooms probably in the far left corner, I'm thinking. Also, there's a rib special Sunday through Wednesday, Thursday through Saturday. You can see the prices there. Soups, flat iron steak. They do have one, one or two tables outside. Looks like we're gonna go to a high top, which is just right here. Right here. Here's a look at the menu. So we've got some fresh salads, some starters, award-winning baby back ribs. I got those last time. My dad and I shared those, and we were mad that we shared. Barbecue plates and dinners, grilled steak burgers, side winders. I also got the corn fritters, right, last time? Yeah. And those were so good. I mean, it was some of the best barbecue we've ever had. So just curious to see if this will be like the same or not. And then on this side, oh, it looks and smells very good. I saw some food go by. We've got the Oakwood dinners, sandwiches. See what the sandwiches and stuff come with in the dinners. Down here, some more side winders, premium side winders, a la carte, daily specials. There's a couple dining and takeout options. Beverages. And then there's all their locations. So we'll have to try some more, but the Lady Lake one was top notch. So I'm just gonna go down the list sometime and try them all. So it seems that if you wanted like a booth table, you had to wait a little bit, but the high tops that are here at the front where we're sitting at, they said you can just, if you want a high top, you can just get seated. So we got seated right away because we wanted a high top. For drinks, we got half sweet, half unsweet tea. I can't remember, I got maybe an Arnold Palmer at the last location and I said it was very good. So going with a little half sweet, half unsweet tea today. They do have so many pictures on the wall back here, but in the far back are where the restrooms are at. There's so many items on the wall. So I'll be curious to see how long this takes. Do you know when we got here? Maybe five, 10 minutes ago? Uh, like six minutes ago. So I'll be curious to see how long it actually takes. Now, when I was in the restroom, I guess the waitress came by and said they're out of sweet potatoes right now. It'd take maybe 30 to 40 minutes to make. So we just did a substitute for sweet potato fries. Um, but also, I know there is in Wildwood an Oakwood Express. What's the difference? Is it just like a order at the counter kind of place. If you know what the difference is between the Express and the non-Express, comment below and let us know, please. I'm excited for this, so I just remember we said we shouldn't have shared the ribs, and then even somebody commented, you guys shouldn't have shared the ribs, so looking forward to it. We ended up going with the rib combo, which you can get pulled pork with. So we did the ribs and the pulled pork with two sides, um, baked beans, and then we did the sweet potato, but since they were out, we did sweet potato fries. Let's try the tea. That's great. It's massive though, look how big this is. 
see some more of the walls, how they've got the decorations up here, and then they've got a lot of fish on the walls too. All right, here's the food, and it took, what, 14 minutes, I think. I think they gave us two pieces of bread last time when we were sharing. Um, oh, my goodness, they still give you a big, healthy portion of everything. But there's the ribs, there's the pulled pork. Last time you said the pulled pork didn't even need sauce. There's the sweet potato fries, there's the beans, there's our sauces. I think I remember them saying red was hot, white was regular. Let's dig in. This combo is actually quite a bit of food. So like we, we have pretty good, decent sized plates of food. What do you think? Just as good? Stinking good then? Don't even need sauce? Looks like quality is sticking up in another location. I'm definitely ready to eat. All right, let's start with the beans. Those are very good. Um, whole pork. Yeah, very good. Now the ribs, let's see. I mean, you tell me if they're, oh, they're extremely warm, if they're fall off the bone or not. Literally, Timber's over here eating them with a fork, the ribs. Very good. This has a little cinnamon butter, but I'm just gonna eat one like this. Those are, those are a little crispy even, the fries, so that's really good. And then of course the bread I remember last time was very good. Yeah, everything's great. I love this place. Did you even try the ribs last time? You tried them this time? What do you think? Very good. You can eat them with a fork, right? So I added some of their original barbecue sauce, like the non-spicy, into the beans, so good, and put it some on the pulled pork, so good. I love their barbecue sauce too, it's very good. Now let's dip a fry into the cinnamon butter. Oh, that looks really good. Yeah, that's delicious. I also just tried a little bit of the, I guess the spicy kind, and it's not really that bad. It's not like super spicy. That was actually, quite a bit of food we just split everything pretty full not like stuffed sick but i'm good all right here's a look at the bill thirty dollars and 57 cents for some really good food that's not bad at all super nice of the waitress she just came by and said you want to go with drinks and she gave us some in their huge cups all right we're heading back outside i think looking at the clock it only took a about 40-ish minutes? Yeah. 40 minutes. So, not bad at all for a sit-down, very good restaurant. That really wasn't that expensive. That platter is really big, so to share it, not bad at all. I was also gonna try to see what time is not busy, but as we're leaving, there's a ton of cars pulling in. So, what time is it, six something? 6.55. 6.55, we got here just around 6.15. It was busy and it's still busy, so not sure when a good time is. All right, that was our trip out to Eustace to eat at Oakwood here in Eustace. I have to say, so far, two for two. Mm -hmm. Their quality of food at both locations, very good. Was there three, two or three more we haven't tried? Something like that. I haven't tried the Oakwood Express yet, so that might be our next one to see what the Express actually means and see if the quality still stands at that location. But so far it's a great place and it's very popular. So a lot of cars in the parking lot. Mm -hmm. Had we wanted a regular booth, we would have had to wait a little bit. In fact, she wrote our name down as the first people to be on the waiting list. But then she asked if we wanted a high top and we just took one of those, um, but very good. Really didn't take that long. 40 minutes isn't that bad to get really good barbecue. Mm -hmm. I have no complaints. Uh, that was the first time we tried the sweet potato fries, right? Or did we get it the last time? No, we got a sweet potato the last one. It was and it was very good. good. And they must be popular too since they ran out. But the sweet potato fries were good. They were cr mm -hmm. like crunchy-ish. And the um, cinnamon butter mm -hmm. definitely added to it. So I think I think at the last one they gave us a lot of cinnamon butter, if I recall correctly. On the sweet potato? <clears throat> so they gave you like a two oh, times yeah, yeah, each yeah. or something. I think you're right. Think. We'd have to go back and watch that. But I do remember my mom saying like, Look at this sweet potato and it like just fell out of its skin. Mm -hmm. yeah. That sounds really gross, but fell out of its potato skin. So it was, it was good. I love this place. Great, great barbecue. If you're in the area near one of the locations, go in and check it out. Mm -hmm. With that being said, 
that does it for tonight. Thanks for watching.